Hey everyone, welcome back to Dead Space 2. We bought some new weapons. Oh, oh, it shows us how many shots we have in total. That's actually really cool. Um, we got some new weapons, so we're gonna be, you know, we're gonna be having a good time trying them out. Oh, that looks great. I'm not looking forward to that. Anyways, last episode I was talking about like echo chambers and having people who disagree with you and why that's important. And you might be thinking, well, why is that important? Uh, I got just... No, oh boy. That's where we need to go. Okay, we need to be careful here. We need to look for eyes. Oh, here we go. Okay. That worked very well, hitting that room. But essentially, I think it's important to foster the ability to hear uh, differing opinions. Um, because it helps. This is lovely. Look at that head. Oh my goodness. It helps foster the mindset. Like, I think it's good. There we go. Okay, and I've said this before, and I'm not really making much headway with this. Uh, you know what? Yeah, we're just gonna do that. All right. All right, there's no one right there. Okay. So the one say wins the race. Oh dear. Yeah, do not want to get possibly by one of the oh. Cool, and I think we got all of them. Uh, and I'm gonna go ahead and save again. So in order to make a point, let me back up a little bit. I think the mindset that if you're not with us, you're against us, can be dangerous and harmful. And okay, we have three nodes. So what do we want? I think we want to upgrade our plasma cutter damage. And actually, what we're going to do is we're going to commit the node and we're going to hang on to the other one. And the idea that if you're against, or if you're not with us, you're against us. I think that's, the reason why I think that's dangerous is because, like, that's not necessarily all the case, right? Like, because this happens all the time. Where people have different ideas. But they can still be your friend. Like, just because you disagree with someone doesn't mean that they're the enemy. Not in the slightest. It, um... Like, even last night, even though I disagreed with my friend, he's still my friend when that is all said and done. And that's important to keep in mind, because, like, it keeps you open-minded. I think that's the root thing, and that's why, if you hear of different opinions, like, I think open-mindedness in general is just a good trait to have, and I think that's really the crux of my whole position. Oh, yeah, okay, I remember this part. Here we go, more plasma cutter energy. Because having an open mind can lead to so many different things. Oops. Right, because we need to save the oxygen. And you might say, well, why do you think it's good to keep an open mind? Uh, I, well, just because, like, I really... Okay, sorry, I'm just trying to see what's going on here. I think just being receptive to new ideas... Like, I'm trying to think how I can put this about just saying, I think it's good because it's good, because it's not really meaningful. Oh, here we 
we go. This is what we want. Here, let's get all the loot first. Again, I'm trying to formulate my thoughts here. Um, yeah, too bad we're in zero gravity, because I don't think that's going to be very helpful for our new weapons. Hmm. Because I'm thinking, because I think it's like, it's almost human instinct to, um, oh, I am so disoriented. Oh, here you go. To resist ideas and to resist, it's not res resist ideas, but we as humans, like, we're resistant to change. And I think that much is apparent, but change isn't necessarily always a bad thing. But then I think that I'm kind of like changing the crux of the argument. Uh, Alright, let's get to know. Oh, I try to say. Oh. Ho ho. Awesome. All right, that worked out pretty well. All right, well, a secret rifle is a fun weapon to have, everyone. You heard it here first. Ah, it's powerful. Two shots. That's not bad at all. We're going to try to use that a little bit more in the future. Oh, we need to go out and get a new one. Gotcha. And I actually think I know what's going to happen in that elevator. And actually, all right, well, I am very greedy and stupid, so we're not going to take a health pack. This is all we really want. So hello, goodbye. All right. And we have stasis. I need to remember this, too. I got so excited about the new weapons, I didn't think about stasis. Yeah, I knew you were there! Oh, we still died. What? Oh, because he probably started the bomb animation, bleh, animation before he killed us. And he's gone now. All right. Well, I see how it is. We killed him too, but then he still got the last laugh. Uh, and the reason why I bring this up because I was listening to a whole. Oh. The steps. He wants me to follow the steps. Step one: crawl into the dark machine. Strauss, calm down. He can't hurt you. He wants me to go into the dark machine, Isaac. I can't go. She's in there. She's waiting for me. Strauss. Oh God! Oh God! Oh God! Strauss, listen to me. Yeah, Strauss is uh definitely not entirely there. You bugger. Alright. I think we took care of him. 
Supply storage, we absolutely want to go in there. Get more supplies, grab... Hmm. All right, that just seems locked because it is. And then we're going to save again. And, um... We're going to end the episode here. So, guys, thank you all for watching. And I'll see you guys next time. So, until then, bye!